everyone, I'm Jillian, this is Ari, and we really have to pee! So bad. <laughs> We've been saving our pee for two hours because we're gonna use these. These wonderful devices. What is it called, Ari? It's the Shiwi. And what is the Shiwi for? It's for, um, you know, you ladies out there who, uh, you know, it really sucks because men can just, you know, whip it out whenever they want and pee on a tree or like, just like, yeah. in a bottle when you're in a traffic jam. Apparently we they do that. We can't do any of that. We can't. When the, when the toilet seat is too dirty, we just have to hover. And, like, yeah, it gives you a good workout, but, like, it's not pleasant. So now we can pee standing up. Problem solved. Hopefully, if these work, we'll, we'll see. We're going to find out. Um, we have to read the instructions. So it says, how to shiwi. Number one, undo trousers. Push underwear to one side. Okay. Place shiwi gently against the body with the outlet pipe directed away from the body. That seems... Like it would be obvious. Aim urine away from feet into a toilet or container. Also seems like it might be obvious. Don't pee on your feet. Um, when finished, pull funnel away and wipe. Liquid repellent surface ensures no drips. Are you sure? What I want to know is how am I supposed to keep my underwear on? I don't know. I don't know. This could go terribly wrong. It says, all right, she was washable, and it can withstand temperatures of up to 120 degrees Celsius, so that's good. <laughs> so if your piss is extra hot. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think it's for dishwasher. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, because when it says washable by hand or machine, I feel like you wouldn't put this in the washing machine. Um, and then it says tips. Practice in the shower to find the best position for you. We did not do that. Two, remember gravity when positioning your shiwi. The pointy end of the funnel should be held more firmly against you than the front of the funnel, which can be held a few millimeters away from the body so you can see the urine going in. A.K.A. tip it this way, not this way. I feel like... This seems like it would very easily just, like, slip into your vagina, and I don't like that. Yeah, I'm not comfortable with that, but we'll see what happens. And finally, ladies, make sure the wind is always on your back. Okay. I feel like we're officially ready to, like, um, have dicks now. Yes. I honestly, I am. So, want to do this? Because I have to pee. Yeah, I drank three Dr. Peppers after I already had to pee. So, like... <laughs> <laughs> She's been like crying. So we're gonna go. We're gonna go. Let's go pee. Okay. Let's do this. <laughs> so this means we can use the men's bathroom, right? Yes. Because we're men now. Yeah, we are men. The only qualification we're... to be a man is having dick. Which we have. Yes. Oh, yes. Gonna oh pee in God. a urinal. Gonna. Gonna talk about what did what do dudes talk about? I don't know. <laughs> Surely they have to talk, right? Like it's too awkward to not talk. Just like right? cause they're right next to each other, so let's do this. Oh no, one of them is very short. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, now do 
do I like shake it off? Now I've got to get some toilet paper from my handy dandy toilet paper roll that they so conveniently left me here. This is <laughs> you can do it, Ari. I believe in you. Do I wipe the pee thing or my vagina? I'm gonna do both. Oh, why is it warm? Sudden realization. These don't flush toilet paper. <gasps> oh, wow. I didn't even think of that. So now I have to... <laughs> this is so terrible. I, think so I don't know what to do. Just... I still have a, like, finish going. Like, I've, like, gone a couple times, but, like... Now we gonna go throw this out? <laughs> there it goes. Woo! Okay. <laughs> Now I guess I go rinse this, like... Okay, um, yeah, where did you put your sheet weight? Just in the urinal? What? No! You, what did you I put it on the top. Okay, but it's all covered in pee. <laughs> I shook it off. Gonna rinse off my sheet All right, sheet is dry. That was honestly terrible. It was awful. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't know. Well, I feel a little better because I no longer have to pee that bad. That badly, yeah. But I also, like, kind of want to go to the girls' restroom now. That was honestly terrible. And, like, pee the rest of my pee? Yeah, it felt like I couldn't. It was, I feel like we should explain first what the problem was. I don't know if it's because it was so uncomfortable. It was either, one, the discomfort of, like, you know, like this pointy end getting, like, a little close to places that are, like... You don't really want pointy stuff there. <laughs> um, or two, it was because we were standing up. That's and I true. think that as women, we're not used to peeing while standing up. So something in our brain was like, no, you can't pee right now. You're standing up. Like, yeah, like that's stop, not loud. halt. Uh. Yeah. And then <sighs> there was also like the nervousness yeah. that it was that we were going to just terribly mess up. Yeah, and I was just, afraid and, like, I was going to pee all over everything. Like it, like, it was just going to go everywhere. So like... Yeah. Well, some it did do its job for like, it did it did manage to you know it didn't make a mess. It, what what little that we were able to push out, um, yeah, I, I did go into the urinal. But it felt like it wasn't my pee that I was peeing. But that's like when I was peeing and I saw something come out of the shiwi, I was like, that's not me. <laughs> you know, it was like disembodied because it was coming out of a big purple penis. Yeah. It was kind of awful. It was. I just yeah no. It doesn't I really, really don't work. Want to do that ever again. I think the thing is like they don't realize that if you get this to like, pee, like like your 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 lady bits level, it's too low. Like your zipper doesn't go down that low. Yeah, that's you I noticed that too. I you had to pull your pants down some. It's yeah, just not viable. Like if you put it like this. That's how it fits in your pants, but also, like, gravity is not going to make it go down that way. It's going to go right back out this way. If you tilt it down like this, my zipper only goes to, like, here. So, like, it's not getting out. Yeah, so... So that was part of the issue. It was really I felt like I had to lean forward, like... <laughs> Probably how guys feel when they have boners. Like, they have to, like, lean forward when they pee. To, like, I don't know. I've heard, right into the I've heard that it's difficult, but, I mean, I mean, I wasn't really worried about aim. I was worried about... Just being Peeing able to pee. Over. I was worried that it was just gonna get all over. <laughs> yeah, me too. I was like, like the moment that thing is, I, that, the first time I was like, I started peeing and then I immediately stopped because like I had to like check to make sure that I had it like. Yeah, I was like almost. I was like almost ready to pee and I was like, oh no, my body just decided not to because and, uh, it's like the pee crawled back up. It was afraid of the light of day. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. Um, well, at least we've solidified our friendship on a new level. Yeah. That it wasn't. It was solidified before, but now it's, like, rock solid. Basically, it could work if you could find a way to be comfortable enough with it. Yeah. If you really, like, like, I guess the tips for the shower might work. Probably, yeah. If you find a way to get comfortable with this, then maybe you could use it on a regular yeah. basis. But, like, maybe. don't wait until you're in a car, like during a traffic jam to like whip this out and be like yeah, this is the first time I'm going to use this practice first. it will be a disaster you will probably cry <laughs> yeah I feel like crying I feel like crying okay I'm going to go to the girls bathroom now. yeah I'm going to actually pee now because right. peace out stay sexy peace everybody peace out